we've been here 57 years. October just gone, and this is still the same firm. My wife, my son, his wife, and myself. That's something nowadays, yes, as you say. <laughs> yeah, oh yes. No, we're still the same people. We've had our ups and downs, many downs as well. The shop behind us here, number 25, Tanners Hill, we took that over in 1955. As the time went on, we had three shops and we had eight in staff just building special lightweight trains. 1958 was our great year when Barry was the junior frame builder when we built the Tour de France bike. We were known as the Rolls Royce of cycles. To celebrate the Tour de France coming into uh, London and particularly into uh, Greenwich and Deptford, Barry is building an absolute replica of the Tour de France bike which uh, he helped build in 1958 for Stan Britain. What we have here is a list of all the frames that, and bicycles that we've made since the early 60s. This is who built it. Say was David Cotton, CB was Charles Barrett. Each frame has a number, which also has the, the uh, listing of the, the person who it went to. On many occasions, they've been sent back to us and then uh, re-enamelled and we've done work on them and then they've carried on. So the, so the frame itself is 50 years old and it's got a history. Unfortunately, like all other trades, uh, cycle engineering by hand that's using an old, old uh, style open hearth with uh, oxygen and acetylene is dying because people do not want to do this sort of work. Two years ago, we passed the firm over to Barry and uh, his partner, Joyce. Barry is now known as a big name uh, managing director. However, both Lily and I refuse to lie down and I still do the finance side and Lily helped me. I haven't got any children. There's nobody really to carry on the business or the, or the family line, unfortunately. Um, and there are literally only three of us left in the, the whole south of England that can do this sort of work. I don't want to see our name go down. It won't go down while Barry's building, but this side Barry hates. And the last thing the world I'd like to do, want to do, is to get a stranger in on it. Realistically, it's, it's only going to be two or three years before we just sell off the property. Where I've got in mind in going, there's fields, there's sheep outside, it's a workshop where you don't get disturbed. I can work two, three days a week. Um, really, to just... I don't think you should stop work altogether, but I don't intend being here when I'm 88. <laughs> no. Retiring? <laughs> well, well, you know. <laughs> no, I'll just keep going and we'll see in the end who's going to retire first, Barry or I. <laughs>